Are you involved in the production and development of cell and gene therapies? Have you heard about the photometric method for quality control? Today, I will introduce you to UVVIS spectrophotometry, a powerful and efficient method to analyze the concentration and purity of nucleic acids and proteins in process steps such as clarification and purification. Watch this video to the end and learn more about our new know-how package about the integration and applications of UVV spectrophotometry in the cell and gene therapy workflow. Let's get started. In cell and gene therapy, high quality and pure DNA and proteins are of utmost importance. UVV spectrophotometry can be used to analyze bacterial cultures, viruses, plasmids and proteins. The technique is based on the absorbance of light. The maximum absorbance of DNA samples is at 260 nanometers and correlates to the concentration when divided by the extinction coefficient and the path length. Proteins, on the other hand, absorb at 280 nanometers and they are considered as impurity in the context of DNA samples and vice versa. The ratio of absorbencies at 260 nanometers and 280 nanometers indicate the purity of the sample. Right now I will show to you how easily such a purity measurement can be done. We pipette one droplet of our DNA sample onto the microvolume platform of the spectrophotometer. Press start and obtain the concentration and purity results directly on the display. Purity values between 1.7 and 2.0 are considered pure, showing that our sample can be regarded as free from impurities. Besides quality, we can use UV-Vis spectrophotometry to determine stability. By increasing the temperature constantly, double-stranded DNA separates in two single strands, which results in an increase of the UV absorbance. The temperature at which half of the DNA is denaturated is known as the melting temperature and is a measure for the stability of a DNA double helix. DNA melting can be used to assess the stability of a final product. In which other process steps of cell and gene therapy can UVVIS be integrated? What other measurement parameters are critical to measure during the workflow? Download our new know-how package from mt.com to find it out. How UVV spectroscopy can contribute to your new therapy.